what's the deal here? We have to, you say in HTML is a markup language, meaning that everything you type must be wrapped in an opening and closing tag. So it's showing me here that HTML is about closing, opening and closing. You will forget as you do the exercises or as you become a HTML developer, especially at the beginning, you will forget to open and close. So always remember open, then close with the closing tag. And then you can fill it in with any any text. In this case, it's telling us to put, hello, I am a text. It's telling you here, please remove the current website content. So I'm removing all the content that was previously here. And add these tags to your website HTML and build your website to see this, the results. Build is this button that we have here. So let me add the second tag. Right now I'm copying and pasting, but when you type, you always have to remember that you open, you close the tag, and then you continue with your life. You should not open, then fill the inside, and then close, because you will forget to close. So please, I encourage you with all my energy that I can, I beg you to open, then close, and then fill inside of the tag. So this is a span tag, and this is a strong tag. A strong tag is very similar to a span, but it's thicker, basically. That's the only thing. It because this is like Microsoft Word. So let's build and you'll see that we have the span tag that basically is just text. The span tag doesn't have any meaning really. It's like the most basic tag in HTML. And then the strong tag looks very strong. You see it's it's replicating all the features in HTML that you had like italic, you have uh, strong, you have paragraphs, you have headings. You'll see in the next exercises. You can see here in the preview that it looks very similar to what was expected. So I can just go ahead and continue with the next section.